Hey guys, welcome back or to me and my channel. For today's video, I decided it would be fun to do a cute little thrift flip. In my spring 2023 fashion trends video, I talked about this one denim mini skirt that I was completely obsessed with. It's like a double hem elevated denim skirt and I'm obsessed. I didn't even look where I could potentially buy it because I was like, I want to make this myself. And I feel like it would just be so much cooler if I made it myself. Plus, I haven't used my sewing machine in the longest time ever, probably a full year. So I'm excited to do a thrift flip that actually requires sewing. So so if you also like this skirt, I feel like this video will be helpful because I think this is going to be a fairly easy thrift flip because not a lot is needed. I don't think it's going to take that long, probably at most like 20, 30 minutes. So starting off really simply with the stuff you're going to need, it's just two pairs of jeans, one pair that's a little bit big for you so they'll probably fit your butt hip measurements and then the top should fit wherever on your waist that you want the skirt to sit and of course some denim sewing needles don't make the mistake of thinking i can just use regular ones because i've broken so many sewing needles because they were not the denim kind so with the jeans i don't it's kind of difficult because i don't want to cut them too short so the zipper gets like messed up but these ones fit my waist obviously so they're going to be the ones that i use for the actual zipper and stuff of the skirt and then these ones are the ones that are a little bit bigger. This is gonna be a tad bit uncomfortable. I'm already feeling claustrophobic. This one, the zipper's not gonna matter. Yeah, so these ones fit me a little bit loosely. I'm just gonna mark off kind of where I think I wanna cut and then go from there. This pair is actually like a skirt now, but these are shorts because like I said, I didn't want to cut it too close to the zipper. So now we have to go, I guess, maybe get a seam ripper or just cut it. It doesn't really matter, but all of that stuff is downstairs with the sewing machine. Now we're going to be pinning the skirt together, like putting them in and then figuring out how I want the skirt to lay and all of that stuff that makes it cool. top and the bottom of this seam instead of doing the middle i think that'll look better i don't have actual like denim thread that matches so what i'm using is just this baby blue thread and then i have like white bobbin inside and i think that'll match pretty decently so even if you see the stitching it'll still be like kind of cute <laughs> Oh, 
honestly don't think I'm gonna need to stitch the bottom part because it's like very secure. She's a little bit wonkier than I would have liked her to be, but honestly, still pretty good. I'm gonna go try it on and then probably cut it to my liking. So currently, this is what she is looking like. It's pretty cool and this is like the style I wanted but it's long still so I'm definitely gonna cut I think maybe up to like right here I think this little detail here of the zipper is pretty cool like I said before it's better for it to be longer at the beginning versus too short then you can't wear it and it does squish the bum just a tad bit but it's double denim so obviously here's some footage with my iPhone just because it shows a little bit clearer <laughs> Okay, I feel like I was better off showing you guys outside of the mirror because you can't really see anyways with the lighting, but I ended up just cutting it kind of a lot more. The zipper actually broke, but I really like that detail about it. It makes it more unique and really cool. I did some distressing on the bottom, and I think it'll just naturally start to fray anyways. Honestly, this came out way cuter than I ever could have anticipated. Like. I love this. Wow, I really underestimated how good I still am at sewing. And this makes me super excited to do more thrift flips and projects. I honestly feel like this was a very easy thrift flip. The wonkiness and all that of it is kind of what makes it mine. Like, I don't know. I'm just super into this and I can't wait to style it. I can see myself doing some styling videos for Instagram or TikTok. So definitely make sure you're following me on both those platforms if you want to see those videos. That's everything for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to like, and subscribe, as well as comment down below because that really helps my channel. You can also follow me on all my social medias that are always linked down below and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.